Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to the Weird Seas, as we're playing a little bit more Dredge today. Uh, I've been playing this the past few days, actually since, um, I played it originally on the, uh, on the charity stream like a week and a half ago. And I had a lot of fun with it, so we played it a couple more times since then. I really like to finish the game because it's, it's kind of awesome. Uh, I'm not sure how far away we are, there may be a couple more streams of this before we get there. But, we're headed off to the Devil's Spine today, which is the last area in the main part of the map that I haven't been to yet. Uh, in search of the last artifact that we need for this dude who's searching for them for some reason. Uh, and then I think this area down here is actually the DLC, the, uh, uh, whatchamacallit? I forget what it's called. Pale Reach, I think it's called. Uh, it was really just on the screen a moment ago. <laughs> anyway, I have time off because I'm off for a week for Christmas this week. And, uh, my daughter's up playing at her friend's house, so... A little more gaming time this week. Welcome everyone who's here in the chat so far, or if you're watching on the channel afterwards, welcome as well. As always, a huge thanks to everyone who's clicked on that join button to become a channel member. Thank you all very, very much for the support. And a, a special thanks to all of our Top Tier Mistakes Are Made members that uh, click that Top Tier membership. Thank you very much. Uh, the question mark is the DLC. I've never been there. Yeah. So, uh, interestingly, the size of the map and where they place this extra region inside the dotted area suggests they're going to have probably like three more DLCs for this game. Which would be pretty cool. It's been a really... Uh, I don't know, this is probably one of my favorite games I've played so far this year. Simple in its execution, but very cool story. Fun to play. Um, I'm gonna go over here. We, uh... As we ended the last stream, we had just turned uh, in the, uh... The, I think it was the fourth artifact. We've got, I think, one more artifact left. We have to get the, uh, the watch for in uh, Devil's Spine, so we're gonna head up there today in search of that. But I still have some other stuff, like trying to catch a blue crab, a snake mackerel... Uh, we've got these rare fish. I haven't gotten the Goliath tiger fish or the, uh, apparently this is pronounced coelacanth, or whatever. Uh, nor the rotting, the rotting conger eels. And then there's a few of those altars that I have, too, that I haven't dealt with. Um, so we're gonna try and, uh, try and find some stuff for that, too. There's this, uh, these gray sharks that I was looking for. Yep, that just happened. <laughs> I'm gonna go fix my boat. Uh, there's these gray sharks that I was, uh, trying to catch last time as well, so they can take them down to one of the, the shrines that we have to supply. But it wasn't going well. I kept, like, getting damaged and then losing them, or... I'd have to I'd get chased away by something and the shark would rot in my, uh, in my holds. Oh, that one just disappeared, but that wasn't the, uh, type of shark we were looking for, I don't think. Uh, we need a little bit more cloth before we can get our next upgrade for our ship. Which is not going to be found here. So that's fun. This might be the shark here that I need. Great. I don't have the right equipment on my boat to even get it. <laughs> Alright, we're not doing that. I guess we're going up to the uh, the Devil's Spine, but i got to fix my boat first because I'm a dummy and I just damaged it. Oh, I should switch over to the uh, speed move here, too. Top tip LG, don't undock. Uh, that sounds close. Oh, dang it! <laughs> We're playing pinball here. We're not even fishing right now. Alright, well, I gotta fix my boat now because I'm a dummy. Repair all. If I'm gonna have any chance of getting those sharks, I need oceanic. Um, this says coastal shallow mangrove and volcanic. This is mangrove and shallow, but I need the oceanic reel. This says coastal and shallow. It's this hydraulic rod that I need in particular. But I don't have room to actually, oh, maybe I need, nope. Based on the shape of these things, I don't have room to actually put this stuff in. Uh, we don't need the mangrove anymore. So I could theoretically get rid of this rod, I guess, and get put it in a different one. We could put it in the Fathomless Winch, but it'll give me Abyssal, Hadal, Oceanic. But I need something that's good for Volcanic, I guess. So I'm, gonna, I'm assuming we're going to need that in the next area. So I'm probably going to need the Versatile Rod for that. I can get rid of this net now, because we don't need the, the mangrove anymore. So we'll uninstall that. And then I have the larger net here. Uh, 
That'll give me uh, coastal and shallow. And then we got here bottomless. So that does abyssal and dull. I think this one, the one I have installed is the only other one that does. Oh, this will do oceanic, but it's, it takes up four spots. Blast. Rod's better than that for now. I think so. I mean, you might be right. We could, uh, I just spent time installing this, but I don't know where to, I don't think I have room in my storage to even fit this in. I've got too much junk in here. Oh, let's see what we can put into, not in research, but in the, um, in the dry dog. I don't think, I, I can't pre-spend on these ones, and I've got to get two more cloth before we can get this upgrade. I should actually see if she's got any for sale. No. He doesn't sell stuff like that. I might have to go to that trader to find it. I have no fish to sell. Dang it! Alright. Feeling a little stuck right now. I can't get the shark thing. Um... Can I even swap this out? Can't. I don't have enough room in here to do anything. <laughs> I gotta go sell some stuff. Now that I just uninstalled this thing. I wish I could like flip it the other way to get it to fit in here better, but I can't. Whatever. I'm stick it there for now. Everything I got is coastal and shallow. Um, okay, let's, um, let's cross over. Spent a whole lot of time swapping things out there. Uh, we'll cross over, I'm gonna sell some junk, and then we'll try and get the, uh, the Oceanic Reel in there. Got a line notification while watching another cryptic video. What are the odds? Apparently pretty good. <laughs> I have some time today, so it seemed like a good idea to, uh, do a little more streaming. Try to get through some more dredge because it's it's hard to find time to play all the stuff I want to play. Uh, these can both go. That can go. This hydraulic rod I could sell. That'll save me space. Same thing with the flexible fishing So some of these fishing poles and stuff I should probably get rid of. I've been holding on them for no reason. I don't really know why. Oh, he only buys things he doesn't sell. You sell your soul to the other gods, you'll have plenty of space for all your stuff. Yeah. Sadly, they don't pay well for my soul. Okay, so... We'll go into storage. We'll get rid of the hydraulic rod. I don't need it because it it's a double up with the fathomless winch. So that can go. I can't sell the sampling device, but I also can't use it. I don't need this net anymore right now, because I don't think I need mangrove. I'm going to sell it. I can always buy it again if I need it. Flexible fishing pole does coastal and shallow. Which this one already does, so I don't need that fishing pole. We can sell that one too to make space. Uh, I already have the tungsten floodlight, so I don't need the halogen spotlight. That can go. I think a little bit of housekeeping was in order. That gives me a little more room to work with. Okay, so let's maybe un unhook the trawl net for now. It's kind of nice catching random fish automatically. Uh, but we'll get rid of this for now and we'll put in the... Uh... Oh, what happened? There we go. Put in our reel here instead. Swift Reaper, have a combined fishing speed of 200%. Oh, okay. That's fun. All 
All right, so now we have Abyssal Hall at all, Oceanic, Coastal, Shallow, Mangrove, and Volcanic. So that covers pretty much everything, I think. And I gotta get some cloth. Okay, we're good. Let's get out of here. We, we already spent most of the day just mucking around with, like, inventory and things. These will be those bronze shark things. I don't want that. I want the gray ones that are out here. Hey, Reeds, how you doing? Cool, an early stream. I'm feeling better. I am feeling better. I mean, I'm not, I'm not better, but I'm feeling better. Does that make sense? I'm on the med. Antibiotics are doing what they're supposed to, so I don't feel like a bag of poop anymore. My voice is improving. Still got the cough and stuff, but that'll take a, a little bit to go away, I'm sure. Uh, I would like to find some cloth. There was usually like some. I thought there were some cloth dredge spots around here. I had found before, which I don't see anymore. It's both pretty fast now. Alright, we're getting nighttime, so that shark should be out again. There it is. This is the one we want here. Assuming we don't get run over by a. Oops. By a weird ghostly fish boat thing. Oh, shoot, I've got this thing in the way. Time to go! Ah! Oh! Complex crap pot, and they wrecked my jet engine. Alright, good times. At least they didn't get the shark. Not this time, fish boat thing. Right, where am I going, even? Uh, it's where this green thing is over here, I think. Get away from me! Apparently, I can turn my light off, and that will make the, uh,. Those red things not bug me so much, but something slithers into my cargo hold. Oh, fun. What's in my cargo hold? Oh, what the? You want you want dock next to an old rowboat? Somebody is here. He's hunched over the campfire, muttering to himself. You cautiously approach. Was he here before? I don't think he was. Did you? Did you throw it back? What? The book. I think you've mistaken me for someone else. I'm not seeing things. It really isn't you. It, it's really you, isn't it? <laughs> I'm I can read. Who do you think I am? He turns away, wringing his hands. He speaks to the fire. It was him. Him and his damned wife that stretched up that old book. But something, something cloaked in fog, followed it out right through the boat. Boom! The man makes crude explosion sounds and motions wide with his hands, still talking to the fire as though pantomiming a story to a child. It spoke! It said something was coming for our breath, that we wouldn't be needing it soon, and then the darkness crashed down. An age later, some of us washed up on the shore, and him? Still clutching that book. Throw it back, we cried. As the fog rolled ashore, we thought, surely, it could still be undone. Uh, what book? Silver and crimson, the book covered in her blood. You're not making any sense. Oh, throw it back! The man closes his eyes tight as he holds back tears. His voice falls to a whisper. Please, the lighthouse keeper. She saw. She knows where it came from. Where it, where it needs to go. Tell me more about this book. Silver and crimson. Silver and crimson. He rocks back and forth, staring through the flames. What do you know about the fog? It cloaks the calamitous thing. It's evil. Haven't you felt it? What does the lighthouse keeper have to do with this? She saw it all that ruinous day. Oh. Ask her. Beg her. Tell her I... He trails off, his face collapsing in sorrow. All right, well, that was sufficiently twisted. The old mayor. I didn't even notice the name. <laughs> this is the old mayor. Poor guy's off his rocker. All right, let's have a little little rest here. 
Uh, anyway, paranoia is gone. It's still dark out, but it's like four o'clock, so it should be getting light soon. Where is that? It's gotta be just around the end of here. Nope. That's not it. Shoot, where was that shrine? Sickly stench rises from your cargo hold. Oh god, they putrefied my sharks! Infected. Well, hopefully they still work for that shrine thing if I can find it. Maybe it's, maybe it's the island down here? But this is where the the dude is that wants the fish. Maybe it's this island over here. I did go there during the day, yeah, and it was just like a campsite where we could read stuff and we could see the bare footprints, but that was like it. Okay, I don't remember where the heck this stupid thing is I needed. Um, maybe it's that other island? Maybe this one down here. I'm gonna get these sharks out of my hold before they go bad on me. ISP. How's it going? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so this is the shark one. I don't even know what these give me. I don't remember what that... I've only done one of these so far, I think. Maybe two. I don't remember what they gave me as a reward. Okay. One stinky shark. How is this even possible? Is it gotta be a, it's gotta be a mix of different shark types. Crap. Maybe I do need the bronze shark type in here. I'm assuming I have to fill in all the squares. Huh. Has to be one of each kind of shark. Ah, oh, is that what it is? I need four different types of sharks in here? Oh, I guess... I mean, they kind of look all the same, but... Okay. Well, shoot. Okay, well, we'll keep this one in the hold, I guess. Sneaky as it is. We'll get one of those bronze sharks and slap it in there next. It's daytime, so we should be able to find another one. Uh, we gotta go all the way back up here, though. I see you on the man. Thanks, Brother Wolf. Took a week and a half before I could finally get antibiotics, but uh, now that I have them, it's... Oh, is this another shark type? That's a ghost shark, so that's probably one of the types I need, right? I can find a way to put it in here. I think that my crab pot is kind of a... There. I'm not going to get two of them right now. Actually, I'm close to this thing. Maybe I should go put it in before I let it go bad in my hole. As I understand, as long as they're inside the shrine thing, they won't rot on me, so you have plenty of time to, to solve for it all. It's just getting it all in there. I'm not even sure what four shark types there are. Maybe is the hammerhead one of the ones I have to have in here? Hope not. Could make for some tricky fishing. Actually, a hammerhead would fit right here. And then, so, and then the bronze shark would fit right there, so I probably do need a hammerhead. Let's go find a hammerhead shark. There should be one around here somewhere. There it is. Oh no, that's a boat. I know there was a hammerhead shark somewhere near this island. Right here. Oh, it's got crazy bulbicides. Let's sell that thing before. It's all nasty on me too. 
think it's do the bronze hammerhead and the ghost shark. Yeah, so I got the ghost shark. We got the the the, uh, the hammerhead. The bronze sharks are easy to get. They're a daytime fishing one near the starting area, so we'll be good that way. All right, that fits right in there, and then the bronze one will fit here. Maybe we'll sell this other one before it goes bad on me. It's already infected. Uh, you know what? I'll go check the starlight. We'll go over here because the um, crab pot's right near there too. We can check and see if we got anything in the crab pot. Hey, your land lovers, your Captain Cryptic. That's right. Captain Cryptic, who specializes in sinking his boat. Actually, I haven't sunk my boat yet. Through some strange miracle. Although we've taken damage, we haven't gotten sunk. Although I kind of suspect with how much damage you have to take, it's not that easy to get sunk in this game. Fish market. <laughs> Uh, this will sell for 57, even though it's infected. So it kind of gets a wow. When it's infected, it sells for a lot less. That's not awesome. Um, I want to no, nope, not that. Let's repair my boat. Ooh, she sells stuff. Does she have cloth? No, of course not. Why would she have cloth? So we'll buy this. We'll buy this. this research is good. It gives me access to the new fancy jet engine. But the jet engine only does 52 knots, and it takes up six squares. Or is it five squares? I'm assuming because this one's got the square drawn in, it must take it up, but... I don't know. This one... So, like, six squares of this would be almost 60 knots worth, but this is only gets 52. It's kind of weird. It's five squares, the square is empty. So I get 61 knots. So it's like a very slight improvement over just having six of the jet drive engines. But with the jet drive, at least if a square gets damaged, you don't lose the, the whole engine. You only lose one of the little squares. So I feel like it's still better. Volcanic and coastal. Oh, I want this. Use that when we go to our new area. Uh, all right, sleep here. Check our crab pot out. I don't think I can get a bronze head over here. I'm gonna have to go back up near the starting area, maybe. Oh, she's loaded. Not enough space. Oh crap. Um, I can load these down here and then move some stuff, and then I can pick this thing up. sell for a lot of those uh, prawns and the lobster. They're just not very valuable, it seems. Mm. Prepare my junk. Let's go drop some crab pots off the other side. Gotta come back over here anyway. it's all prawns around this island prawns and lobster or there, there's other things i gotta figure out where to find the blue crab probably should have googled it no uk friendly live stream hey boss how you doing yeah i don't get to stream during the day all that often but when i do i prefer dos Equis. <laughs> throw a crab pot in here oh this has few though 
few. We don't really want few. We want we want more of the plenties and less of the fews. Throw one there too. See what we get. I don't know. There'll probably be more prawns and stuff. But... Lots of small jet engines felt strong to me when I tried it, but I think it was quite expensive too. I mean, it's expensive, but it, they're each one of them is nine and a half knots. Um, they only take up a single square, so if any one of them gets broken. You're only losing nine knots of power versus that other engine. If one one of the squares where that engine is gets damaged, you lose 52 knots. So it does seem like it would be a better idea to have all the small ones. Yeah, we'll catch this one. Huh? Is that we're already here, Mr. Go Shark for the hold. That is more metal, which I have too much of at the moment. I say that now until I need it, but this looks like treasure. Treasure! Just a wee little ring. And here's the shark. Eat. Don't go away. Don't, don't lose it. Don't lose it. Yes. Crap. <laughs> it's depleted, but I don't know if it's depleted because I got it all or because it's like time of day. Uh, we need to go south. Where are you? As long as we're here. Ah, blew it. These are normally good money, so hopefully, you know, uh, hmm, uh, hmm. There we go. Tetris solved. One in six critical Fox viewers are smart enough to find the thumbs up button. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the, uh, everyone who has clicked the like button. I have no idea whether it actually makes a difference or not from a YouTube perspective, but it is nice to know people are enjoying the stream. It is really foggy. I don't like it. Too foggy. I can't find my way. Okay, our last shark goes right, whoops, I had it right in the first place, goes right in there. Slide four sharks into the fissures and they slip down out of sight. Moments later you spot something rising towards the surface of the water. Viscera crane. A traitorous device crafted in the deep that will raise its kindred to the light. Alright, that's fun. Oh wait, did I put it in the hole? Please tell me I put that in my cargo. Where did it go? <laughs> I hope I didn't lose it. I, I, I middle click that I didn't. I wasn't paying attention. It went to storage. Oh good, 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 good. I'm not sure if it could or not. You know what? I probably shouldn't sail around here in the dark too much. Oh boy. I'm gonna go. What the? Alright, caught an octopus in my crab pot. That's weird. Turn the camera around to look behind me. He's hard in this game. Doesn't want to swing very quick. doing today not bad not bad it's a Friday I'm not working instead I'm playing video games so uh, I'll call that a win mm. glaring arctic person eh, 
Got me like 126 when those things aren't sick, so that's nice. Those shark doesn't sell for much. But the black tip reef shark are good. Those are good money. I like those. There it is in store. Can't take it. The viscera crane. Or the viscera crane, depending on how you choose to pronounce it. Alright, so we did the shark shrine. Um, there was a crab shrine around the other side of that... Around the other side of the islands over here. I don't remember where exactly. I never did put any crabs in it, because I don't know what it takes, but... Yeah, cold's getting better. I'm not, uh, I'm not 100% yet, but my voice is, uh, largely recovered now. I'm not coughing nearly as much as I was. And antibiotics. Who knew, right? Bislam Hall is a nice combo. I like the Viscera Crane. Yeah. But I've got this one here that has Coastal Shell of Mangrove and Volcanic, and then this one for Abyssal Hodal and Oceanic. So I've got like a triple set. The th nice one with the Viscera is the, um, the boost to the, the Twisted Fish. Okay. Uh, I don't remember why I had that green thing there. Is it just the campsite? It's gotta be the campsite. Yeah, I guess I had it marked for the campsite, although I still don't remember why. It's fine, I guess. Sorry, teenagers. <laughs> oh, the barking. I gotta mute for a sec because my dogs are going nuts for some reason. to see if I can figure out a way to get another sailfish in there, but I just don't think I can. They're too big. Uh, all right, in the cabin, on a pursuit's way... So I have to catch a blue crab. The snake mackerel, which I haven't found, I suspect it's going to be in the place we're headed to. I think with these rare fish. Uh, the rotted conger eel. Should just be able to uh, just hold on to it for a short while. They start to rot pretty quick out in the sun. Oh wait, do I just have to hold on to a conger eel and they start to rot? There ought to be a few living uh, in the center of Gale Cliffs. I didn't find any conger eel, did I? Or did I? Maybe I just didn't find any rotted ones and I have to hold on to it until it starts to rot, maybe? I don't know. Let's go check, see what we can find. No, I'm proud of the raid. Hey, proud. Thanks for the raid. I welcome anyone who might be popping in. Just a small daytime stream today. We do our little fishing adventures. I might have to. Oh no! <laughs> I might have to uh, fish at night for the eel, though. It's not my favorite thing. Since that guy's swimming around. As long as he's there, though, he's not over here. Ah! Ah, crap. It'll learn to drift better. Hold on. Uh, let's go with the Banish. Keep that handy just in case. I might need it. These aren't eels, but we'll fish here to kill time. If 
Where is he? Those look like the conger eel right there. Ah, I missed. Conger eel, got it. Okay. Maybe that's the first time I've caught any of these. Oh, crap. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have fished that one up. Uh, hold on. Can I relocate this stuff anywhere? That didn't help. All right, well, that one will have to wait, because I don't have any room for it. Fairly certain there's nothing I can do to set these differently and actually get that thing in here. All right. Let's go back. Now let it age, but not rot. So it's got to, like, start rotting, right? I just can't let it, like turn into a pile of rotted goop. Get out of here, water spout. In the meantime, we'll sell the fish we got. 22. So it's still fresh. Uh, 107, 20, little bits. Little bits. Okay, shipyard repairs. They're fixed again. <laughs> I'm, I'm like specializing in damaging my boat these days. Oh, actually, I should see if she's got cloth. I don't know if she ever carries cloth, but... You know, she's often got the research, though. I'll buy these. Put those to work. Uh, I did want some... To research the last pot, maybe. No, actually, we'll get this net. Because we're going to need the volcanic, I think, for the place we're going to. This fishing speed, 130%. This fishing setup is neat because it's got like the, the fast fishing speed, but it only covers like three things versus the four that this one has. Now, it does have oceanic in it, which is nice. Also, shallow oceanic. How's it compared to the real I have? That one is a Bizzle and Hadal, though. All right. Uh, we'll put this in a pot, I guess. Is there a rotting net? Rod for which? I think the crab shrine gives you a very nice crab pot. I believe you. I gotta check and see what what crabs I have to put in that thing. Um, still fresh. I'm gonna sail around this island and see if we can find any cloth around it. There's wood. Which I'm gonna need later, I'm sure, but don't need right now. Didn't really expect their cloth would be the hard thing to find. Uh, we got treasure here. Ah, I screwed that up. Stay in the center of a campsite. There's fires, uh, embers are cool, but ash is still steadily blowing out in the wind. Take a look, a close look at the campfire. Large flat rocks, it's the char charred wood, the uh, charred wood of the campfire. Handful of tiny fish bones can be seen poking under the ashes. Kick the ashes. Your foot hits something hard in the bottom of the pile. You brush through me. Oh, there it is. Thanks. 
for footprints. You find no footprints, but unfamiliar symbols have been etched into the dust nearby. Some have been erased with the hasty sweep of a foot. What do you want to do? Check the makeshift tent. Tent's a sheet of cloth suspended over some sticks. There's nothing inside save for a smooth hollow in the dirt where someone slept. Can I take the cloth? I need it. Okay, now this is stale. What's that? Leave the eel in the sun. Can you do that? Not really. You just sort of have it in your hold. It's already aging. It's uh, it's stale now. It's scrap metal. I don't need right now. Cloth. Yes. Oh yes. As long as the big fish stays away, we can finally get an upgrade on our ship again. Okay, nice. Two of those cloth will get me the upgrade that gives like plus 15 to our hold, so we'll be able to hold a whole lot more fish. Think it's good to deliver it stale? Alright, we'll try. We'll sail over here and see what they say. Brought you a stinking eel type thing. Was it the ring yeah. resin we needed it? I've got a conger eel here. Let me see. Oh, hmm, that's a conger eel, alright, but it's not sufficiently aged. If I take it now, the dog's sure to snatch it before it ages. Please come back after it sends some time to mature. That is gross. Just saying. Alright, this guy sells the explosives. Probably just rest here, but um. I do want to expand. Oops, I do want to expand my boat. So let's go over here. We'll do that. Raid! Another raid! Prowl raided a little bit ago. I caught that one. Uh, alright. I don't think I had any fish, did I? Just the eel, which is now rotting. It's perfect. <laughs> I can't. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, hold on. We gotta go back. It's now rotting, so I can't, uh... can't risk having it go to pieces on me. Because it'll take time for them to upgrade my boat. Ah. Here's the aged conger eel ah. you asked for. Perfect! This will do wonderfully. I can offer you a small summon, thanks. Safe travels. Oh, that's it? I don't even know if that was worth all the trouble. Thought I was gonna get something neat, but nope. I got money. I mean, money's alright, but it wasn't exactly a lot of it. Hi, nerds. Hey, Brittany. Nerd! Gonna get lots of use out of that button. Uh, alright, shipyard. Oh, no, not the shipyard. I need the, uh,. Down. New haul plus 15. Oh, baby. These can go into storage. Purchase for 1500. Boom. Tier 4 haul upgrade. Okay. Now we got these other things we gotta do. That's for the light. I like the idea of more motoring. I also like the idea of more fishing options. I only have one cloth, so that's not gonna. I'm not getting that one right now, regardless. This will give me four more hold, which again I need more cloth for. Motors, it is. How you doing, Timber? So we got a cat cam coming on again. Timber's back. You know, it's about wearing a dark shirt. This, uh, the light is always just so much more dim when I'm on camera. Funny how that works. 
What are you doing, buddy? Two more engine spaces. We got, uh... Not enough of anything else. Okay, we're good. Timber wants to play video. Yeah, he's an attention hog lately. Every time I'm, uh... Every time I'm here now, he's like... Deciding to come and get a little camera attention. Never lost the cam! Hey, Brittany. Well, I only just turned it on. I didn't have it on a moment ago. He just jumped up here to say hi, so... Sharing the cat wealth. No, okay, get your... Let's... You can't drink my tea, and nor can you butt rub my camera. Or my microphone, thank you. It's my tea, not your tea. Hey. Crazy cat. Alright, if you're gonna be up here, you gotta rest. I mean, you're getting in the way. Sleep time. Oh, that's my chin. Does he come sit with you when you're at work, too? Uh, sometimes, but not as often. I, um, I have a... Just over to my left here, I have my laptop that I use for work, and I'm not... The way that I'm facing that way, he just doesn't feel as inclined to want to jump up in front of me. Imdurek Tetris, yes, it was me that moaned about a previous dream. I'm lazy and proud. <laughs> I feel like if it was... I don't know. It, if it just, like, automatically... You can, you can automatically pick stuff up, but... It won't necessarily place it the most efficiently. I do feel a little bit like if it was too easy, it would be, I don't know, too easy. That makes any sense. So check our crab pots. I'm going to pick those up. Uh, so we can take them up north with us. We're going to head up there and see what, see what we got at the Devil's Spine. We went to the Devil's Spine and we found a herniated disc. on my microphone. That's really annoying. Just watch it with your two. Maybe they can smell the age conger with your two dogs. That was really loud growly noise. You know, you are really demanding today. Better leave. I'm sure you have food. I checked earlier. Pause going now. Um, that's a whale shark, and apparently not fishable. if it ever comes up to the surface. Excuse me. Jimmy doesn't like when I cough. It gets all disturbed. Ah, oh, we got a gold one. Ah, uh, where am I going to stick this? Pick it up. Okay, we're all full. Guess we gotta, we gotta get out of here. Let's go up. We want to get up north now, so let's. Uh, we'll just teleport over to the Blackstone Isle, and then we'll go from there. Floaty boat. Why did the lobsters sound moist? <laughs> well, I mean, they did come out of the ocean. I only had two things to sell that guy. That's all right. Uh, where 
the point now where we might need some more wood again, so let's grab this. Oh, wait a minute. I've only got enough space in my hold for one. Playing Oki from work? No, I have the week off. I, uh, I get... I take two weeks off at Christmas. I did a little bit of work yesterday, but... Because I could never entirely avoid it. Uh, but I don't actually have to be working this week. And I will not complain about that. Except I spent most of my two weeks sick. I'll complain about that. Uh, okay, we've got room for two more... Two more of the jet engines here. So we definitely want those. Not the right dock. Sadly, she only has one. Sorry, I still got to cough sometimes. So much more room for fun and games in here. Uh, let's sell this off. We'll get the larger light. Light up the night. Have a combined strength of 3,000 lumens. I can lumen all the lumens. Okay. We're good. Let's get out of here. Oh, it's getting kind of late. I'm actually not going to be in a position to go up north just yet. I would prefer not to sail up there at night. So we'll grab the wood here instead. All one of it. What are the game you playing today? I have it scheduled already. We're going to play some more of the Abiotic Factor playtests. Uh, that'll be the usual 9 p.m. stream time. 9 p.m. Eastern, anyway. Uh, I already have it set up. And then this stream is set up to just automatically forward to that one. Uh, even though it's going to be a while afterwards, but I figured people could put like a reminder or something else. I think of, of the games that I've tried recently, because uh, we've tried a whole bunch of new ones that were like betas and play tests and what have you. Um, Abiotic Factor might actually be one of my favorites. It's not like graphically realistic or anything, but it's kind of a novel concept for a survival game. Being in a lab and all. It's got a neat sense of humor to it, though, so... It means you go fast, you can get the boat going. I've got, uh... It's got quite a bit of speed now, actually. Kind of went into the wrong spot. Uh... I mean, I've got enough now for this. But I just bought a new light, so I don't know. Plus one light space added. Do I have any extra lights in the, uh... There's no four slot one, but do I have a... I don't have a single one. We do a cloudy lens and add an extra 20 lumens. All right. There we go. 20 more lumens is... <laughs> now we have 3,020. Oh no, this is 750 lumens. It's 20 meter range. So, 3,750 lumens. That's alright. Kind of might, it might get in the way of more fish. Maybe that wasn't a good idea, but. Hopefully, it'll be alright. Uh, she has the other motor. Okay, so now our top speed is 104 knots. That's pretty fast. It's like a veritable speedboat now. Why are these green over here? Oh, it's showing what it's where it's going to add them. Okay. 
That's cool. I don't think I even need this piece of refined metal anymore. I don't think there's any more options that'll even require it. What do I do? Just sell those? Or maybe I'll hold on to it for now just in case the uh, DLC's got something for it. But... Hundred and four knots. This isn't a fishing boat anymore. This is now, this is now absolutely pleasure craft. <laughs> Look at this thing go. I can smack a rock at incredibly high speeds now. What I should've done was bought that fishing net and put it on. Change my mind. We're not ready to go yet. Look at it go. It's crazy. I'm gonna bump it at every rock at that speed. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, -oh. uh oh, actually. I'm gonna have to move a few things around. This isn't cool. Um Okay, this has gotta go. Over there. So I'm gonna move this out. And then we need that new net. I only got a three spot left here. Is there an oceanic rod that only takes up three by any chance? Oh, this is the shallow and volcanic. Okay, that'll give me access to the volcanic that I need. And I still got my net in place. I should actually put it on the other side. That would have been a better use of it. Maybe I'll do that now so I can kill in time. But there we go. That way when I want to put my six slot net back in over here, it's already ready. So now I've got all this stuff at the top we can do. Everything but like mangrove, I think. Shallow, oceanic, abyssal, hadal, volcanic, dredge. What am I missing? There's something else that I could do. I think it's... Is it just mangrove? Oh, coastal also. Alright, I'm not super worried about coastal though. Wait, the, this does coastal. Alright, good enough. No, it's, already, it's already late again. <laughs> Spend so much time moving things around there. My, my boat's gonna need vendors? Yeah, almost certainly. I wonder if you can even catch fish in a trolley net going at this speed. <laughs> Look at it go. <laughs> Grabbing speed! You have to grab this when it's on Steam sale. I'm cheap. I think it might already be on sale. Hold on a second. Uh, store page. It's on sale right now, it's 25% off. So it's uh, in Canadian dollars, it's 24.37. Hold on, let me share this. 24.37 Canadian, obviously, depending on what your currency is, it might be different. And then the uh, the deluxe edition, which comes with Blackstone Key, digital art book, digital, whatever. Um, and there is the DLC for it also. And the Pale Reach is. Not on sale, but the uh, the base part of the game we haven't even gotten to the DLC part yet. The base the base game's on sale, twenty five percent off right now. This looks like tuna. Ooh, that's slow. He doesn't like when I cough. Sorry, I disturbed the cat, everybody. No more cat cam. He's moved on. 
He's like, forget this, I can't even rest here quietly. Blackfin tuna. I'm not even gonna bother fishing any more of those. They don't uh they don't really sell for much. Wait a minute, I haven't been to this island, have you? Okay. He's got buildings on it I haven't seen before. 1650 UK pounds play Tetris. I think not. That's pizza. <laughs> You're not going to get hours and hours enjoy of enjoyment out of a pizza, though. That's the problem. Ah, oh, there's the snake mackerel I needed. Just happened to catch it in the net. Coastal, of course. The one thing I don't have. That's some kind of an eel there. That might actually be the snake mackerel. Fortunately, we caught one in the net. Another campsite. Small structure sits on the island nearby as an abandoned campfire. What do you want to do? Examine the structure. Old structure is built around a statue. The statue has its arms raised toward the lighthouse of Devil's Spine. There's a lighthouse over there? I don't see it. Unless that's it right there. Whether its gesture is in fear or praise, you cannot tell. What do you want to do? Check the campfire. Camp for itself is unremarkable, but you wonder who would choose an island such as this to make camp. Nearby, you spot a piece of paper flapping in a bush. A note is written on it. You put it in your pocket to read later. Ah, so I got a lung. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's see what that note contains. Close now. Nobody knows. Does he know? Desecrated temple. Forgive me. The only way he might understand. Must help him. Must stop him. Okay. All right, we got that sneak back. I should take that thing back so we can get a get rid of it and b complete that little objective and see what that guy has to give me. That is. Is that cloth in there? Looks like cloth. We need a little more cloth. Yep. Ah, that paid attention. Let's see what else is around this island, and then we'll, uh... Fast travel back down south there, so I can... What the heck is that? I guess that's just volcanic water. A little bit of lava showing through. Just a little bit of lava. off it's your own ship or whatever there's only few crabs here oh plenty 40 30 some on a few plenty 26 meters down drop them both here for now I can pick them both up later back off get your own fish oh no 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 not doing that Another crazy one. <laughs> Trophy tuna. All right, let's do uh, a little fast traveling. Ooh, look at the waves. Didn't crash. Where's the real cryptic fox? Yeah, yeah he's, he's in hiding. 
Okay, uh, we gotta go all the way down south here. To, oh wait, no, the guy that wanted the eel was over here somewhere. He's actually closer. Back off! It's my boat, you can't have it. right here, was it? I think this might have been the crab that was wearing the pirate ship. Oh, it is right here. Almost fulfilled. You point to a fish in the final scroll. This one is a snake mackerel. Holy snake mackerel. Fishy barely left her hands before the splintered nails begin peeling off its scales. The heart is extracted and devoured. Their head tilts upwards to look at you. They take a book from inside the robe and hand it over. Hunger. Sated. Now. I wait. They cross their arms and appear to fall into a deep sleep. Alright. That's fun. Oh, wait. Haggling a bartering guy. Yes, please. I'm sure that'll give me better prices for things, which would be awesome. Okay. Uh, I guess we can... Hop over to the dusty pontoon over here to quickly sell some stuff. Maybe we can steam up north. It's a straight shot from here, basically. This boat is so fast now. <laughs> this is great. Teleportation looks rough. It does, yeah, the whole exploding thing is a bit much. Thought your stream was lagging when you weren't hitting the gaps of the mini game and still succeeding. I am smirk. <laughs> um, fish market. Mm. Something dusty pontoon sounds like a, a stage name. <laughs> I'm not gonna ask what kind of stage you're, uh, you're paying attention to, but maybe. Two seventy six. That's a decent chunk. Including the stuff that was in the net, of course. Uh, it's the shipyard. No, not here. I want the, um, shipping dock on it. Hey, remember all that metal I said I didn't need as much anymore? <laughs> now I need it. Take the straight shot north from here, I guess. That's a red one. Maybe because I'm paranoid. It's freaking chasing me! <laughs> God dang. Should be decent money. Something I sell them quick enough, I guess. All right, we're headed this way. Do I release a schedule or anything? Uh, sometimes I do. I'll pick. I'll make a, a comment on. Uh, on the community tab, I'll post what I'm going to be doing for the week. Other times, I kind of decide on the fly because I'm not really sure you know, what else is going on. Between work and family stuff, it's uh, sometimes a little bit chaotic. Hard to know exactly what I'm going to be able to fit in. Uh, but tonight, we're playing some Abiotic Factor. Tomorrow night, I'm planning to play State of Decay 2. But uh, again, it'll uh, you know, depend on whether A, my body's still cooperating or not. and. Holy freaking, what the heck is that? Spider crab. A freakishly huge crab from the depths. No, you're not kidding. Oh my good God, that's an ugly freaking crab. I can't even fit the dang thing. 
Uh, can I put it back in the net? Okay, I'm good. I don't think I have any way that I can place this that I can actually fit that thing in here. I'm curious what it sells for, though. I'm gonna have to leave one of the sharks behind. Huh. Alright, I'll get rid of one of the sharks. I just want to see what this crab sells for. I have a feeling the shark was probably more valuable still, but we'll check it out. That's why they got crabs. I think you need those for the sacrifice to the altars. Hail skate. Well, there is a, there is the crab shrine thing that I haven't found yet, but I don't know. Oh. Market. Sells for 88. Not as much as the bronze whaler, so I lost a little bit of money by ditching the whaler in favor of the crab, but... That's fun. Oh. Anything for sale in the shipyard I need? Just the research. Man, this area is noisy. Research complete! Reinforced crab pot available. Okay, so that's the fishmonger. I got one of those fancy nets. Nets, crab pots, whatever. I guess it's more of a cage. I'm assuming I don't want to hang out where the bubbling is. <laughs> it's gonna be like a weird geyser that pops up there. I just want to see if it's going to damage me. No, it doesn't. Unless something happens. What the heck? Are those red eyed fish? Oh, it's coming right for us! That's not cool. Back off, evil fish! Oh, I should not be trying to escape them in here. I want that fish that's in that building there. I think our light didn't go out just now. A rap shark. Which is just a basically a twisted ghost shark. Area sounds very unstable. <laughs> sells for 144. Good grab. Tusk eel, snake mackerel. What else did I have to find for that rare fish thing? Goliath tiger fish and coelacanth, or whatever it's called. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna, let's put out the crab pot while I'm here. See what that gets. Can't lobster and crab in the game? You can, yeah. I just I just threw the crab pot in the water. Um, we've caught lobster. We've gotten shrimp. 
bunch of different fish and stuff. There's crabs for sure. The crabs don't seem to sell for a lot, but you can catch a bunch of them. Alright. Let's uh, explore some more and see what else we find around here. I wonder if those red-eyed fish are going to go away when the sun comes up. Those don't seem very friendly. I didn't like the way they chased me. Ow, oh, they're on my boat! Am I taking damage? I can't tell what they're doing to me. Do they steal out of my nap? What do those things do, I wonder? They're definitely chasing me. This boat is so fast now. You catch me, you little jerks. Oops. Chat. Bad. Oh, fish being haggling and bartering. Nice. They want to drink from my toilet. That's inappropriate. Red fish will slow you down and bring a very large fish. Oh, do they bring like that giant, whatever it is, pretty big skate kind of thing? Stuff over here. <clears throat> How long you can catch crabs? <laughs> uh, I mean, it depends on who you're hanging out with, I guess. Whether they ever seek medical treatment. You can drop the crab pots if you're, if you're asking honestly about in the game. <laughs> There's, uh, you can drop the crab pots wherever you want to, just about. Depending on where you put them in the water will depend on the types of crabs that you catch. And the pots will last a few days and then you gotta like pull them out to repair them kind of thing. Alright, let's see what's up with this dock here. This is a little ominous. A man me choose you dock, bracing himself against the wind spray. Oh, rapturous day, a fresh disciple carried to me atop the waves. Come ashore, weak thing, and rest your weary soul. Uh, I'm just passing through. Nonsense! Your arrival is providence from the deep itself. I've been calling, and now you are the answer. The rite of purification is almost at hand. You had to be my replacement. I'm listening. Your trial begins immediately. Tell me. What does your spirit seek? <laughs> what is your name? What is your quest? Happiness, sadness, or emptiness? Happiness. Ha! Merely an excuse to halt the skirch for something great. Happiness is, by definition, a compromise. And your flesh, what does it crave? The warmth of the sun, the sting of the salt, the chill of the water. Let's go with the sting of the salt. Pain is a trick of the flesh. Do not surrender to it. Finally, what does the world deserve? Everything. In a way, it deserves all that is washed ashore, freely given from the deep, but no more than that. The trial is concluded. You still have much to learn, but that knowledge will be delivered to you in time. Now, your role as my initiative is to act as the herald of the purge, just as I was for the one before me. The nearby spires blaze with eternal life, yet the stone hearths of these three idols lie barren and void. Retrieve three fathomless flames from the crags behind us, and ignite the crucibles. Visit the shrines of the deep, I will mark them, they will offer further guidance, and I must provide no more. Well, good thing the fanatic's not weird. 
Stone columns of the temple are carved with ancient pictures and texts. Which carving do you want to look at? A swarm of small creatures. The carving shows a swarm of small fish surrounding a boat. The ravenous children, alone they are nothing. Together they summon her. Beneath these words, somebody's added a crudely scratched note. Do not let them grip you. Burn them away. Stone columns of the temple are carved. Okay, there we go. Uh, large eyeless beast. Carving a large fish with crossed out eyes. The unseeing mother. When the starving cannot eat, she approaches. Beneath these words, somebody's added a cruelly sketched word. Blind, but can hear her children. Avoid at all costs. The bubbling vent. Carving shows a bubbling underwater vent. The breath of salvation. It burns those that mean harm. Only the pure remain. Somebody's added a cruelly scratched note. Protection. Follow the magma. Find them. Magma. Okay. So the bubbling vents are good. I would not have guessed that. Probably good thing we read that note. Alright, let's go back over to here. Ramming speed! I don't have the lights on, so those uh, red lights can't hurt me. What the? Squat lobster? <laughs> I don't have enough room on my hold. I gotta get rid of some stuff. Oh. Frilled shark. It's worth a hundred. That's all right. Uh, all right. So that got me a couple of the metal that I needed. A couple of the wood that I needed. Four cloths, which I actually don't think I need. Oh, I do need some. Okay, so no point in hauling up any more cloth because it doesn't appear that I have any use for it. Unless I can like sell it or something. Actually, if I'm at the shipyard, maybe I can check here and she'll buy it. That does sell. 1150. 115 for the refined metal. Okay, I don't know what to do with these crabs. But oh my god, there's three of them in here now. Nutty. Get some B-52s. Get a cream for them. <laughs> Always with the crab jokes. Oh, they're worth 46 a piece. It's not awful. It's not great, but it's not awful. Need my other crab pot over here too. Two crap outs, I guess. This game writes itself, yeah. <laughs> oh, look at that disturbing. An umbral puppet. Nasty. Oh my lord. Okay, this is a good good area for these crabs, but storing them is a real distinct problem. Literally can't pick the darn things up. My pot will have to stay here. Well, they sell for 98. That's a pretty good price. 
158 for the Umber Puppet. Long limbs hang idly from a body mounted with blackened spheres. Waits for the call of the void. Waits, the f <laughs> Waits for the call from your mother. Mm. I'm assuming to get in there and get the stuff, I gotta lure these guys away. Tablet. Ancient stone tablet bearing a strange glyph. Maybe the trader at Little Marrow knows something about this. It's mm -hmm. weird. Just plain old fish. Yeah, with those little ones in the bubbles. So we have something we gotta explode over here. There's a big fish in there. Oh, that's the blind one right there. Holy, look at the size of that sucker. Oh, what's this? Stone shrine, an upright slab bears a carving. Two heavily plated creatures locked in battle. Lower slab holds two. Okay, so I need one of each of those two crabs I found. Okay, so we can plump that in there. Let's see if we got some more of those crabs in this particular crab pot. There's one of them. Double fish crabs are worth a lot, apparently. So any of the demented fish are worth more than the regular variety. And the crab itself is already worth a decent amount there. Oh. that. Get some bonus fish. Let me go... to unload the, uh... crabs I have over here. I need that crab pot.
Ah, sorry everybody, I accidentally hit the mute button when I was coughing. I forgot to turn it off again. So we got the two crowns we needed to open up that shrine, and I got me one of the flames that I need for the, uh, whatever that other weird shrine is about. Mm. Grunt fat from countless corpses that rest in the deep, the harbinger of sick mercy for lost souls. Wonderful. Lashes out with its teeth, its tail, a hissing rises from its mouth, and then from the water around it. What the shrines do? So th those ones I put the crabs in it, it opened up to give me some stuff, but I don't know about the one I need the flames for. And mm. This is my first time playing through this game, so I'm still figuring that stuff out. The story is gradually being revealed to me over time. Uh, I didn't mean to go there either. I to go here. Two metal and two wood still for this thing. Alright, so we can go over with the uh, the one flame I got. And we got some more exploring to do here to find more. Okay, we want to go to the statues. Which statue do you want to look at? Left, middle, or right? Does it matter? Statue holds a stone crucible. It's empty. Cold flame roars in the statue's hands. I don't want to look at any of them. Alright. Oh, there's like a whole trail of lava down here. I think it said I have to, I'm have supposed to follow this, right? <laughs> As I follow the lava right into the evil fish of hell. Ah, give him my boat. Oh, these little jerks here. Oh, oh god! That was great. I just broke my winch. So shrine, an upright slab bears a carving. Two malformed fish writhing under the sun. The lower slab holds two shallow grooves. What kind of fish? Any fish? Two malformed fish writhing under the sun. Will any malformed fish do? I wonder if I have to have specific ones. Fish. They're a pain in my butt. Should probably go back and fix my boat up. Equipment broken, fishing effectiveness reduced. Oh, that's interesting. I just thought I couldn't fish them up at all. I didn't realize it would just reduce the effectiveness. Crazy. This lava should take me to the last shrine. Right? Oh, what's this? Ancient ruins. Oh, safe haven. Visit every dock of the game. I guess this is the last dock. It's in the cave. In the dim light of the cave, you can make out some paintings on both walls. Check the left wall. 
Paintings depict the birth of a civilization. A great beacon of light is shown repelling a tentacled figure emerging from the sea. The dim light of the cave, you can make out some... Uh, check the right wall. These paintings depict the fall of a civilization. A volcanic eruption tears through a tall lighthouse. Monstrous shapes devour people as buildings turn to ruin. That's crazy. Let's open the ancient lighthouse. Climb the many steps leading up to the ancient lighthouse. Uh, at its base is a, a solid stone door. You can see a handle, but there's a large socket carved into the face of the door. Or oh, can't see a handle, but there's a large socket carved. <laughs> I'm guessing we can't put a crab pot in there. Alright. Must be like, maybe like a larger stone tablet we have to put in there? Either way, I don't have it, so... Rules that out. Door remains shut. You don't say. This whole area is rather weird. The paper I found earlier? I don't I can't look at what's in my hold right now. I'll have to look. Looks like we need some explosives. Getting a little dark and murky. <laughs> the eye flag, nice. Puts my hand on the stone. Doesn't do anything. So it doesn't have the runes lit up on it, though. What's over there? What's that glowy business? Oh, God. Alright. Not good. Get some lights on in here. Oh, boy. Big fish. I don't know where I am right now. This will keep me safe. Can fit one of them. These crabs are huge, man. How many can you put on a boat, uh, testing for science? Well, there's some that are really small, so you can have quite a few. But... Ah. Alright, let's get our boat fixed. Mm. Back to being chip and shape and stuff. Um, I want to go to the floating dock so we can put the wood in here. That leaves me just two metal that I need to get that. I should probably go back to the town to take that stone tablet back there and find out what the deal is. We're done blowed up. A little less spooky over here. These sell for a good amount, so as long as I see them, I might as well grab them. No. Thing going on. Best action game right here. This game's actually really good. 
I'm sure it doesn't appeal to everybody. Like, somebody who's into, like, first-person shooters is their primary game interest is obviously not going to be into it, but... It's just really well done. Ah, hmm. uh, um, hello. What can I do for you today? Show him the stone tablet. The trader takes the stone tablet from you and inspects it closely, turning it over in his hands. Hmm. Remarkable. Yes, I do believe this is a fragment of a larger arrangement. Reaches up to a high shelf and brings down a similar-looking stone, albeit one covered with much more dust. Some years ago, I acquired this other piece. You found this near the ruins in the Devil's Spine, didn't you? Yes. Ah, well, I suspect there will be more out there. I'll hold on to this one for now and study it further while you search for the other fragments. So I need a couple more, I guess. Hmm. What, like two more? In the meantime, do you have any trinkets for me? Does it? Yeah, I do, actually. Buy all this crap off me. Thank you for your money, good sir. Take this flag over to the painter, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we might as well put it on, also. Eric with the 12-month weather message. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to you and your fam. Well, thank you for the 12 months of support. Greatly appreciated. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to you as well. A couple days now until we're in 2024. Craziness, man. Dark, raving craziness. I didn't get a whole lot of sleep there, did I? Okay, let's go sell the, uh... Sell the fishes over here. Something slithers into your cargo. Oh, you just infected my fish. It's not going to sell for as much now. I saw a little line across the water. I didn't notice that before. Longer? Wait a minute. Did I hit the wrong button with all those items I had? I thought I sold them all, but I guess I just put them all in my hold. <laughs> so dumb. Thought I was getting money. Uh, yeah, the infected ones, they they sell for a hundred less. That's crazy. That, that cost me a good chunk. That was lame. That's lame right there. I'm not. I gotta go back because I didn't sell all that crap. Smirk that way. Ah. All right. Uh, I'm gonna back over this way. Wait, so that would have added a new thing to my cabin, right? Oh, I got a couple messages I haven't read, too. My darling, I found you at last. When you left, I was scattered to the winds, but now I feel almost whole again. There's just one thing left to do. Throw me back. <laughs> what? Yesterday was the reading of his mother's will. Most of the remaining estate went directly to him, of course. But to my surprise, she bequeathed me her pocket watch. Curious. I'm not fond of the thing, but I know that taking it will mean a lot to him. Can I help but feel it is some veiled jab at me from beyond the grave? It was the right type to do such a thing. Was that late on some occasion? I cannot recall. Let's light the statues. Searching for the relics. Find more tablets. Trader says there are more tablets to find. Should I bring them to him when I find them? Or I should bring them. So I need... I don't know how many I need. Couldn't tell me. Question mark. It's all a big question mark. In God's name is that? Wait, that's gonna need a little camera action right there. No, no camera, camera. Ah, I wrecked it. That thing's huge. It's too deep for me to get a picture of it now. That sucks. What is your problem, dog? That was gigantic, man. I'm guessing I probably didn't want to get run over by that thing. Uh, so I don't remember where I found that tablet. 
Oh, I guess it was it was in that little campsite, wasn't it, on that island? I wonder if there'll be more of those in this place somewhere. Oh my god, dog. She's so upset. I think I might have to put her out. fish. I have to turn on that uh, fish repellent ability I got. Ooh. We got ourselves a gold one. I got an achievement. Catch a hundred crabs in pots. Oh crap. Oh crap. We gotta be this way. Screw off, fish. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Good thing that doesn't damage my boat. Ah, uh, fish markets. 49, 63. Yeah, I mean, it sells for more, but it's not like crazy amount more. Oh, wait, I need the. I saw it from that. Oh, I got another one of those weird fish. I'm gonna take that over and see if it, it will suffice. I think it said one of seven tablets. No, it was like one of question mark, I think. But we'll double check. Yeah, it's one of question mark. Hope it's not seven, because I don't know where to find seven tablets in this game. <laughs> I need a 360 fender. I need something. Good size crab in there. All right, we need the, the banish spell effect. Um, so over here was where that other shrine was, but I don't know exactly where. And I don't remember. No way you even have a my way in there. Oh, I forgot I needed to buy exp Oh, there's those evil fish in there. Um, forgot I needed explosives, too. I can actually blow that wall open right there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back off, fish. Turn you into a McWitch. Catch right in that thing. I guess in this early action, there's more to come. Uh, very well, might be. I don't know. The, 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 it was a paid DLC for the additional content, so I don't think it is early access. They've had one DLC come out. It looks like there's enough room on the map for like three more of them, but whether they actually plan to do them or not, I'm not sure. me four extra hull spaces, which is nice. Oh. Didn't really fix anything? I'm all right. Fix up the net. Excellent. Wait a minute. Did I accidentally sell the fish that I meant to keep? Mm. No, yeah.
Oh, crap. I was going to buy explosives. That's what I wanted. Uh, should be alright. There's only got one explosive, huh? I have to go back to that whaler to get some. This thing's ready again. So there's a sparkly wall there. Just get me into that area. They haven't noticed me. Back off. I guess we're fine, metal, which is like Ow! Back off, you evil little jerks. Can you get me? That's right. Get out of here. full release it has a couple updates also yeah and they've got uh, one DLC that's out for it so far oh, I don't need that. the pale reach ah, I wasn't paying There should be something else going on at this place, but nothing here doesn't seem to do anything. Oh my god, there's so many of those. Oh my god, they're really slowing me down. I got you little jerks. Peace. They're annoying. Come, in, come get toasted. I don't care about... Where was that shrine that I had put the one... Oh, it's gotta be this here. Two malformed fish. Um, so I don't know if this will work with just any fish. Rock splits to the mighty crack. Oh, dead. Perfect. What the heck is that? Encrusted talisman. A stone tablet surrounded by tooth and bone. A glyph of a hook is carved in the center. Okay. Look It's in the storage, so that'll work. So that's two of those things open.
Those steam vents sure are handy. Early speed. I am feeling a little better, thanks. Yeah. Not uh not perfect yet, but improved. A lot for a couple hours anyway. Okay, let's get rid of these. I bought that explosive intending to use it, then I didn't use it. We have a second flame, though. Let's, um... Let's get my boat fixed. Actually, I guess it's just a net. We can teleport back with that other tablet. Explosives to get at that big fish. Yeah, I um, I gotta go around the one side. I need to find the spot where I spotted that. I think it was around a different area than I was in. Not that any of that made any sense. Um, all right, sell that. Sell this. Sell that. Wait. Oh. Some tablets surrounded by a tooth and bone, a glyph of the cook, and uh, a encrusted talisman. Oh, is this not... I thought this was one of the tablets he was looking for, but... Fishing speed, plus 330%. Oh, maybe I actually install this. Oh, it's big. Alright, I guess that's like something I can install on my boat to go faster fishing or whatever. I thought it was uh, something for this guy. Well, that sucks. Well, at least we get to unload some, unload some loot, I guess. Whoa! Dry dog, that's what I was here. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember why I came over here. Uh, I'll put the wood in here. Two more metal, two more wood. Another research point we can spend, too. Just down to rods and nets. Everything else is already researched. All right, well, it's 5.30. I've been live for about two hours. Uh, I need to, uh, I need to call it for now. I've got to do the whole dinner prep thing or whatever. Um, we got to find at least one more of those flames and, like, some more X number of those tablets. I don't know how many we have to get. We can continue to do that next time. Thanks so much for uh, popping in this afternoon. Bit of an early stream. I don't normally do many of these. Uh, I do still have a stream plan for tonight around 9 p.m. Eastern time. I'll be playing Abiotic Factor. The uh, the place test for that is still live. Uh, had fun with that last time, so hopefully uh, the adventure will continue. Uh, but thanks so much, everyone. I'm as always Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.